Hello, how to solve for s and y in this problem? s plus y is equal to 6, x, y is equal to 36. Then we quickly want to find the value of s and y. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Here, s plus y is equal to 6. Let's call this equation 1. And x, y is equal to 36. Let's call this equation 2. Then from equation 1, s plus y equal to 6, we can make y the subject of the formula, y is equal to 6 minus s. You may also make s the subject of the formula if you want. Let's call this equation 3. Then from equation 2, that is sy equal to 36. Let's substitute for y. Then we have s bracket 6 minus s is equal to 36. Let's multiply out s times 6, that is 6x, minus s times s, that is s square, is equal to 36. Now this is uh, 6x minus s square minus 36 is equal to 0. Then we can rearrange this, minus s square plus 6x minus 36 is equal to 0. Let's divide all through by negative 1. Then negative s square divided by negative 1. This is s square plus 6x divided by negative 1. This is negative 6x. And then negative 36 divided by negative 1. That is plus 36 equal to 0. And this is a quadratic equation. We can solve this using quadratic general formula. And quadratic general formula is giving us S is equal to negative B plus or minus square root of negative B square, negative 4AC divided by 2A. Then where A is equal to 1, and then b is equal to negative 6. Then c is equal to 36. s is equal to negative bracket negative 6 plus or minus square root of. This is minus. C is all square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 36 divided by 2 multiplied by 1. S is equal to minus times minus 6. This is plus 6 plus or minus square root of minus 6 square that is 36. Minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 36, that is 144 divided by 2 multiplied by 1, that is 2. Then S is equal to 6 plus or minus square root of 36 minus 144, that is minus 108 divided by 2. Now, but 108 is 108. Can be written as we have 2. 2 in 10, that is 5. In 8, 4. Then 2 in 54. 2 in 5, 2 in 14, 7. Then here, 3 can go. 3 in 27, that is 9. 
three nine three we have three that is one then here we have two multiplied by two that is two square then here we have three square then and then three so therefore one zero eight is equal to two square multiplied by three square multiplied by three and then we know that square root of minus one is equal to i then our equation become s is equal to six plus or minus square root of two square multiplied by three square multiplied by three multiply by minus one divided by two then s is equal to six plus or minus square root of two square that is two multiply by square root of three square that is three then square root of minus one is i then root three divided by two now s is equal to six plus or minus two multiply by three i this divided by two and this divided by two root three two here one two here three two here one two here one of s is equal to three plus or minus three i root three therefore s1 is equal to three plus three i root three and s2 is equal to three minus three i root three. We've gotten the value of s1 and s2. Let's solve for y1 and y2. Then from three, y is equal to six minus x. Then y1 is equal to when s1 is 3 plus 3 i root 3 we have 6 minus 3 plus 3 i root 3 y1 is equal to 6 minus 3 minus 3 i root 3 y1 is equal to 6 minus 3 that is 3 minus 3 i root three also y2 is equal to six minus s2 then y2 is equal to six minus bracket s2 is three minus three i root three y2 is equal to six minus three plus three i root three then y2 is equal to three plus three i root three therefore S1 is equal to 3 plus 3 i root 3. Then S2 is equal to 3 minus 3 i root 3. And of course, Y1 is equal to 3 minus 3 i root 3. And S1 is equal to Chili plus chili i root chili.
then s comma y are S1, Y1 is equal to 3 plus 3 i root 3, comma 3 minus 3 i root 3. Then S2, then S2, comma Y2 is equal to 3 minus 3 i root 3 comma 3 plus 3 i root 3 you can see that s1 here is equal to y2 here and then y1 here is equal to s2 here we can check to confirm if this answer is right or wrong let's check to check we have the given equation s plus y is equal to 6 then sy is equal to 36 now let's use any of this equation s plus y is equal to 3 plus 3 i root 3 plus 3 minus 3 i root 3 must be equal to 6 then this we cancel this here we have 3 and 3 that is 3 plus 3 must be equal to 6 3 plus 3 this is 6 is equal to 6 which is true now let's consider the product s y is equal to 36 then s multiplied by y this is equal to 3 plus 3 i root 3 root 3 multiply by 3 minus 3 i root 3 must be equal to 36 then here we have 3 multiply by 3 this is 9 minus 3 times 3 i this is 9 i root 3 plus 9 i root 3 and this is 9 multiply by i square multiply by root 3 square but i square is equal to minus 1 then this we cancel this here we have 9 minus 9 multiply by minus 1 multiply by this we cancel this 3 must be equal to 36 this is 9 minus multiply by bracket 9 times minus 1 multiply by 3 that is minus 27 must be equal to 36 then we have 9 minus times minus 27 that is plus 27 must be equal to 36 then here we have 9 plus 27 this is 36 is equal to 36 which is also true i hope you enjoyed the video thank you for watching please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe to my channel bye